Hi everyone, my name is Michelle Lamb. I'm a solutions engineer here at BetterCloud. I'm excited to share with you the power of Zero Touch IT with BetterCloud custom triggers. You'll see how I'll be able to turn a manual process into a fully automated one. Today, I'll be walking you through an example scenario using the Greenhouse recruiting application, specifically the use case of initiating onboarding when a candidate is marked hired in Greenhouse. Let's get started. When an organization hires a new candidate with Greenhouse, they typically have to rely on memory and leverage disparate systems to simply initiate the onboarding process for their new hire employee. As you can see here, before a better cloud solution, a candidate will be marked hired in Greenhouse. From there, HR is going to notify IT that an onboarding is impending. IT then has to remember to reach out to the manager for approval. And then once that manager actually approves the request for onboarding, IT needs to open a ticket and finally manually onboard the new employee across several different applications individually. This introduces error and you run the risk of your new employee starting on their first day without the proper tools they need to succeed. Every step of this process that you're seeing here before Better Cloud is entirely manual. Next, we'll see how this process changes within Better Cloud. With Better Cloud, as soon as a candidate is marked hired here in Greenhouse, automation takes over entirely. Our automated workflow will notify IT via email that an impending onboarding is in the horizon and simultaneously we'll send the manager approval here. Once the manager approves, a ticket will be opened and provisioning will be rolled out across a number of applications automatically, files and folders, and even update a ticket proactively from opened to closed. Best of all, this workflow can be customized to run sequentially in the order that you want and it's detailed enough to add those special touches to warmly welcome your new colleague to your organization on day one. Next, I'll take a look at what this process looks like in action. You'll wanna navigate into the integration center within the Better Cloud platform and add an extension to your installed greenhouse integration. This will allow you to create a trigger for workflows. Click into the installed application, select modify, and add an extension, and select create a trigger for workflows. After selecting next, I'll start by then inputting a name for the trigger. I've input new hire onboarding ticket because I want to initiate the onboarding processes. So as soon as I hire a new candidate from within Greenhouse, it's going to kick off the ticket within Better Cloud. I'm gonna go ahead and select next inbound request. And I'll be taken here into a screen that's gonna populate a better cloud URL endpoint. This is a unique URL you'll use as part of your webhook build in Greenhouse Next. You'll use this URL to tell Greenhouse where to send the valuable data we need in order to trigger the workflow. So keep the screen open and hold tight. Next. We'll flip over into the Greenhouse Recruiting Platform to build the webhook trigger action we need to initiate the workflow. We'll go to the gear, click on Dev Center, and select webhook button that you see on the screen twice. You'll see I'll also have to name my webhook here. I'm going to put new hire onboarding. Select the when dropdown which shows you all of the actions available within the Greenhouse system to trigger a webhook from Greenhouse to Better Cloud. I'm gonna click Candidate Has Been Hired because this is the action I wanna trigger the Better Cloud workflow. So we'll be listening for this action in Greenhouse once set. I'll copy and paste that unique Better Cloud endpoint URL, and then I'll input my secret key. Finally, I'll click the Create Webhook button at the bottom. Now, when you flip back into the Better Cloud system, you'll see that the webhook test was received. You'll configure the endpoints received on this next page and save and publish there at the bottom. Now you can go ahead and build out your workflow. Here is just one example I've built out. It's triggered when a greenhouse candidate is hired by HR. 
You can include an optional if statement. Uh, I put in here the department name of sales, and then you're going to see that I'm giving IT a heads up when an onboarding is imminent. Further approval is sent to the hiring manager for the onboarding to start. And then once approved, a ticket is created automatically to start the onboarding process.